Hey riders, Eric with Ride Adventures here with a quick tip for you on reducing upper body fatigue for a lifetime of successful adventure riding. So riders have been coming to us more and more, especially as we get older, upper bodies, our hands sometimes are struggling with the rigors and the challenges of taking the pounding that adventure riding puts us through. And so real important point I try to drive home to them is to take pressure off of your hands and your arms by putting that support and engaging in your core muscles and your butt muscles and your hip and pelvis, that whole area down there, just like in every other sport, having an engagement down here and squeezing the bike with your legs if the situation calls for it, or just controlling yourself with those bigger muscles is gonna, again, take some pressure off of what you have to do up here. You know, this doesn't apply so much if you're just cruising on straight road and it's not a big challenge, but as you get into more intricate situations and you're dealing with the bouncing of the rocks or whatever, not having so much pressure on your hands, but instead transferring that requirement to your core muscles can go a long way in, uh, you know, making things last and making sure you can get through a long day and of course many years of adventure riding so take pressure off your upper body and your hands and your grips by engaging your core muscles your butt your pelvis working on those muscles instead of the small ones so hope that helps and we'll see you out there